Hello. So today we're going to be talking about the difference between convex and concave polygons. So as you all know, a polygon is just a series of sides connected in a closed loop forming some shape, right? This is a polygon. This is a polygon. It's just a series of sides that end where they start, that connect all up to close this space off. Notice you must have at least three sides because two sides do not close off that loop or make what's called a closed loop. So what's the difference between a convex and a concave polygon? Well, a convex polygon is a polygon in which you can choose any two points. We're just going to choose some arbitrary two points, but the point is that you can choose any two points. And when you connect them with a line segment, that line segment will never exit the shape. So that line segment will always be contained. And notice we can choose this one, maybe, and we can choose this one. Notice if we try to connect those, they're still inside the shape. They're on the very edge, but they're still part of the shape, right? They're still either inside or on the edge of the shape. So that's convex, and they usually look a bit bulgy. So you can usually classify them just based on whether they look bulgy or not, like this, where they have sides that stick out. Right? These are, I'm going to label these. These are going to be called concave polygons. I mean, sorry, convex. Use the wrong word there for me. Convex. Concave polygons, on the other hand, are the opposite. The opposite case is true for these. So for concave polygons, I'm just going to make one here for you. If you choose any two points, in, in one case, if not more, you will have a line that exits the polygon. So look here. If we choose this line segment, we choose two points, we can form a line segment between them. And the inner part of that line segment actually leaves, right? This little portion here is not inside the shape, the polygon. This is how you classify concave polygons. I'm just going to draw some more here. But it's just a useful little piece of information to know. There can be lots of different concave polygons. Let's see, how many sides do we have on this one? Two, three, four, five, six. Two, three, four, five. You can make all kinds of different ones. Notice that you cannot make it with a triangle. You can, however, make it with a pentagon and all kinds of different polygons. But the main rule is that there is a case inside this polygon when two points chosen, when a line segment is formed between them, will have points on that line segment that are not points within or on the polygon. So this will come into handy in the next couple of videos, but I hope this is a pretty clear definition, and uh, thanks for watching.